What's up, everybody? Moped here. <clears throat> you can't tell. I'm a little sick today, so I figured um, since I really can't smell or taste anything, we'd do something a little different just to kind of bring you some content. So I have these batteries that um, need to be rewrapped. I know some people um, have never rewrapped their batteries and probably don't realize how easy it is and could fucking pretty much, you know, save your hand or whatever. It's really important, really important to make sure your wraps are good on your batteries. So, so with these ones, as you can see, um, the wraps starting to come off like the top. And it's just because like one of the mods I have when you sometimes when you take them out, the contacts will kind of grab on, and yeah, and they start to kind of rip like that. The sides and everything are pretty good. Still, see like that neck right there. That's no good. That's pretty bad. <clears throat> and then. Yeah, this one's just kind of starting to do it. But honestly, once you start seeing wear in your wraps, you should rewrap them. Um, you don't need to necessarily, I would wait for them to get really bad. I would just, it's just better to rewrap. Um, like I got this big, I got this bag of wraps and I think it was like four or five bucks for what was it, 240. <laughs> and you can get them from anywhere. Amazon sells them. I think these ones I probably got from Amazon. Uh, fast tech most of the vendors like I'm pretty sure um, element vape probably sells them but a lot of the vendors will sell them just just find them wherever you can um, you should also buy the insulator that white part right there that keeps the positive and negative it kind of protects the positive so you know because so if you don't know how a battery how these batteries work that metal right there is the positive part of the battery and then the whole rest of it is the negative. And that's why it's really important to keep good battery wraps on because whatever is exposed besides that, that positive part is, ne is the negative part of the battery. <clears throat> so it's extremely easy to get a short um, if part of your battery is exposed. So just Whenever in doubt, just rewrap your batteries. That's the best way to do it. And you could also buy the insulators. I don't have any on me right now. But yeah, you should just, they're cheap too. Just buy some insul insulators and replace those as well. So yeah, so we'll go ahead. So all you really need is, you know, the batteries you're gonna rewrap. Um, you're gonna be black. Uh, a couple battery wraps. Uh, these ones are nice too. Uh, the pre-cut is already like cut to size, but you can also buy them in rolls and a blow dryer or a heat gun so i got my wife's blow dryer <laughs> she hates when i use it but i don't have a heat gun so that's what i use and i got my little pod because i'm sick and it's about the only thing i can really vape on right now all right so obviously you, you want to take the old wrap off oh come on Oh yeah, and you don't really want to use anything metal to take off your take off the old wrap. Um, and if you do, just be really careful, kind of how you do it. All right, so I got the wrap off. So that's just you know exposed battery. I also I used my uh, so what I did was, see, I mean you can use something metal to to get the wrap off, but you've got to make sure that the metal you. Do not, you'll short out the battery if you like connect. Like if you touch it across here like this, because this is still negative, right? You do not want to make a connection between the positive and the negative. So I use my ceramic tweezers. I also stab myself with them. <laughs> so you still got to be careful because I'm just vulnerable and, you know, I'm just going to hurt myself, find any way to hurt myself. But uh, yeah, ceramic tweezers are good. I kind of just got under there and, and got it started, you know, and then peeled it off. But uh, just be really careful, it, especially if you're, just be really careful with like metal and, and when you're working with batteries because you really don't want to like accidentally short your, short your batteries out. All right, so we got our insulator. So put your, put your insulator on there. And then take your battery wrap, open it up. Try and get that crease open a little bit. And just stick it in. 
<clears throat> okay, and then what you want to do is you want the insulator to grab or the the wrap to grab around that insulator. So you want to leave enough space on the top so that happens. But then on the bottom, you don't want it like this or something. You see, because you want you want the whole sides to be um, to be covered. So, but you know, you want like pretty much an even amount of space, kind of on the bottom and the top. Okay. So, oops. All right, so something like that. Get a little bit of space on both. Let's there back on there. All right, all right. So you want to put it at high heat and then start it off low. Um, and you kind of want to start at the top to get that insulator in there. There you go. Top's good. Bottom's good. Rewrap battery. Mm -hmm. Then just do it to your other one. You are good to go. So hope this helps some people out. Um, stab myself. <laughs> Anyways, hope this helps some people out. Uh, Rewrap your batteries, safety first, all that good stuff. And until next time, eat, sleep, mix, repeat. Be good to each other. Talk to you all later.